Sleep is vital for good health, but many of us are struggling. Experts recommend adults under 65 get between seven and nine hours of sleep per night. But according to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention in the US, 35% of us report sleeping for less than seven hours per night on average. At least I know I'm not alone. I've tried using podcasts, white noise, pretty much everything, and nothing's really worked. Now this is the Friends Brain Band from Earable Neuroscience, and they claim that it can use a variety of sensors to measure seven different metrics, including brain waves and your facial movements as you sleep. The headband has bone conduction headphones, which sit just above your ears. They play audio content in response to its sensor readings in real time, including meditations, nature sounds and music. The inbuilt AI then learns how your brain responds to different types of sounds to try and figure out what's most likely to help you drift off. So I'm just looking at the graphs here on the screen and it's showing me three different things, one of which is the EEG, which is my brain signal. Uh, that's pretty flat at the moment, which is, you know, pretty on brand. And then underneath that, we've got eye motion, which is slightly strange. It, it looks like it's detecting when I move my eyes around and it's reacting on the graph. So that's pretty funky. And then at the bottom, it's facial muscles. And if I kind of open and close my mouth like that, it also reflects on the graph here. So it's pretty impressive that it's detecting all of that just from something that's basically wrapped around my forehead. We have done a lot of brain stimulation using audio, using electromagnetic signal. We stimulate and then we measure how the brain responds to that. So that's the uniqueness of this device. It understands you. When I first wear it, it would play piano sounds, hoping that it will help me to relax and put me to sleep. I play piano, so every time I hear piano sound, my brain really active. So since then, it doesn't play piano sounds anymore. It only plays natural sounds and it helped me to sleep faster. The company claims its brain band can get you to sleep an average of 19 minutes faster than usual. So naturally, I'm going to give it a go. So I've been using the band for a couple of nights now. I sleep on my side and that meant that it was a little bit uncomfortable um, but perhaps more of a problem was that I woke up in the morning to lots of alerts on the phone saying that it had actually come off. The company's creating a new version to submit for FDA approval at the end of this year in the hope it'll one day be used by doctors to help treat sleep disorders. This is the first step toward diagnosing at a much lower cost as high of a quality as that compared to the devices in the hospital. The goal is to bring this to the clinical world to help people with the actual strong need uh, for improving their sleep. Researchers always like to collect sleep data in as natural a setting as possible. It will be immensely beneficial to have one of these headbands. Instead of traveling every day to a sleep clinic to do this, if you can do it at home, that is much, much better. So that's tech you can wear, but what about tech you can sleep on? South Korean company Ansil is showcasing its unique mattress design, which is supported not by springs or foam, but by strings. 14 million of them. The string tension and mattress firmness is adjusted by air that's pumped inside. It also contains sensors which can detect your body shape and position as you move throughout the night and adjusts firmness accordingly. So if you are a side sleeper, you need like soft level. If you're a bad sleeper, you more firmer. You cannot keep the same position the whole night. But just to show you, I'm going to do it manually. OK, great. Let's so, do it. This is like the level 10. Yeah. So 10 is the most firm. Yes, most firm. But I'm going to put it, this minus button, press easily. Oh yeah, you definitely feel it going down. There's an integrated smart scale which measures 18 types of data, including BMI and muscle mass. It takes a while to take all those measurements, so now it's time for a well-earned lie down. So you're on the mattress, you're looking very comfortable. I want us to live here. <laughs> what is it doing with the, the data that it's collected from you that we've already seen? The data is combined to this application. So when people first use this mattress, 
we need the default level based on your body shape, your, your, your muscles, your height. My default level is entry number three. And then if I keep my change posture, then probably that number is changed accordingly. The system is clearly recognizing when Daniel changes position, but it seemed to have issues distinguishing between back and front sleeping positions. The measurements come together to give you a score on what's known as the Ansel Experience Index. So closer to 100 points, the more quality and balanced life and sleep condition you have right now. Of course, it's quite difficult to properly test something like this on a show floor. But how much potential does it have for improving sleep quality? We all know if you don't have the right mattress for you, that's going to ruin your sleep. I mean, it can give you a backache, it can give you a shoulder ache. The price of the Ansel mattress and smart bed system ranges between five and seven thousand US dollars. Although we might one day see devices like these being used more often to help improve our sleep, it might be a while before they're affordable and accurate enough to benefit most of us.